Hello fellow simmers and welcome to this tutorial from Flight Sim Productions. Today we are going to learn how to make a symbolic link. And what that's going to do is it's going to help you with some stored space on your SSD drive for those of you who are running prepared 3D. It's rather simple and uh, rather quick to do. So let's get to it. First thing we're going to want to do is go to where we have our prepared 3D saved at. In my case it's the C drive, program files, Lockheed Martin prepared 3D version 4 and we're going to scroll down to our Orbix folder. Now this shows that it's empty because I've already copied it over to my new drive to save a little bit of time on the uh, tutorial here. There's my D drive and I have my Lockheed Martin stored there for all the extras and there's my Orbix folder. Now in order to get it over there all I did was simply drag it from my C drive to my D drive and I just let it copy everything over and once everything was over I made sure that it was all there or what I could tell was there so I double clicked on it checked and everything looked pretty good next off what I had to do was go back to my C drive where Orbix is stored and just click off to the left there in the white area until everything is all lined up and or rather lit up blue do a control C and I strongly suggest that you use notepad or wordpad or something and copy that right in there that directory because we're going to be using that here in just a little bit put a couple lines in there and we're going to go back to the D drive where everything is now stored gonna do the same thing do a little copy and come back over here and paste okay now that we've done that because we have some spaces in between some of the words here we have to put some quote marks at the beginning and at the end it's a, just something you have to do in order for this to work so we're going to put some quote marks before the C oops don't want to do that we're going to put some quote marks after the X and we're going to do the same before the D and after the X there as well and once we get that done, we're going to go ahead and we're going to go down, or actually, once we get that done, we got to go back to where we have Orbix originally on our C drive and get rid of that folder because if we don't, it's going to cause us some problems and it won't work. So we just hit the delete key and continue and away that goes. Now what we can do is go down to our command prompt and if you go to the little window icon in the lower left, if you're using Windows 10, just click on that start typing in C M D that's going to bring up your command prompt window you're going to right click on that run as administrator in this window you're going to type in MK link just hit enter or return after the systems 32 line here we're going to type in MK link space slash D capital D make sure that you get the capital D in the correct slash we're going to copy the first line that we took from where we have our Orbix now and just right click and it will automatically put it in there do a space after that then do the same for the next line which is on the new hard drive that we have that we are that we have copied everything to and when I hit enter what you should see is like a little shortcut placed in Orbix that's not a, a shortcut though it's it's called a symbolic link that's cool and since it's in there it looks good we can go ahead and get rid of some of these windows and test it out and see if it worked for us you don't need to save any of that stuff because hopefully you won't need it again so we're gonna open up our Orbix and uh, that's totally my bad I clicked somewhere I shouldn't and as you can see everything has come up it looks like we're all linked if it wasn't linked it would say something like needs to install or there would be an error message and then you would have to basically re-download everything to link it and there's Bob Bob's not installed so Bob doesn't count then what I'm gonna do is make sure the X-Plane sceneries are loaded and I only have a couple and they're free ones and they look fine and that's it folks that's how you create a symbolic link so you can move all that Orbix scenery over to a different hard drive free up some space if you like what you see 
throw us a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Check us out on Facebook at facebook.com slash Till next time, keep your head in the clouds.